All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to format your dashboard. So let's say you already have something kind of basic put together. How do you make it kind of more you, right? More the way you want to see it. So the first thing you can change is your formatting. And the way you do that is you go format and you can go workbook. Now, the difference between going to workbook and let's say editing this individually is the individual one you have to do every time, right? Whereas the format workbook is the default format for everything that you create. So if I go all, I'm going to change this to, let's say, Tahoma, right? It'll change everything to Tahoma, okay? So it's like a theme. It's much nicer, right? So let's say regional sales. Uh, it doesn't look very good. Let's say webdings. Ugh. I forgot that that's what that does. Let's go down here somewhere. Let's go stencil. Oh, that looks cool, right? But a little bit hard to read. Let's change it again. Let's go sego. Sego. Or is that Segway? I can't remember how you spell Segway. All right, I'm happy with that, right? And there's a few other things you can do. You can change your titles. You can add dashboard titles. So I'm going to close this for the moment. All right, I'm going to add a, sh a dashboard title, and I just click on this bottom button right here, right? If you can't see it. It's just this one here, dashboard title, right? And to format this, I can just double click it. I can go my very first dashi, right? I can center justify. I can change the font size. Let's make a bold. Let's make a blue. Okay. And then dot dot dot. And go OK. So I've got that there. I can do the same thing for these titles. Right? I can put this in the middle. Do it for all three. Okay. There we go. Um, these filters, actually, let's change this to um, single value. Let's get rid of the sales one. Um, and then this one we can leave as so, right? I can change these titles. I can just double click again. Let's make a bold so you can see a little bit better, right? And what else can we do? Uh, these things I tend to get rid of because it's kind of implied that they're regions, right? So I can right click here and go hide, right? Uh, sales profit, that's fine. This one I actually don't like because it's so kind of takes up too much room and I can't see anything. So I can either go back to the sheet by clicking on, I think it's this one, right? Or when I get to this one and I activate, I can click on this button. It takes me straight to that sheet. And the benefit of that is once you have a lot of sheets, um, it's hard to find the one you're looking for, okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this from uh, this way to switch it this way. Then I'm going to add some labels. So I can add them individually, like so, right? holding control. Or I can press this button up here. OK, if I click that, they all now have labels. So it's a neat little trick. OK, my only problem with it is it doesn't actually create a tile here. OK, I want a tile that's there because you want to be able to edit things, you know, a lot better. So we'll go ahead and do that. Bring this to labels. Bring this to this label okay good and let's go back to dashboard one all right so that looks a little bit better right this heading we don't need because we already say it's subcategory so let's right click hide oh what did i press i think i rotated right click hide all right so again it gives me a bit more room this one let's make it a little bit shorter because i don't really need that much space there okay and then also i'm probably going to move this down here Okay, let's see how that looks. Yeah, now that doesn't look good at all. Let's bring that here. Let's double click this and let's call this sub category. Oops. Okay. All right, and let's make the font slightly smaller. Let's go 11. Just because it's kind of a small part of this one. Okay. So those are just little things you can do with formatting. Again, you can change your colors. Let's get rid of this thing. All right. And it's just to kind of like sleek it up a little bit, just so you don't, it's not too busy, right? So those are like the formatting things you can do with uh, Tableau. Again, super easy for the dashboard. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.